What is going on YouTube and welcome back to my YouTube channel, Texas Toy Hunter. Today I'm going to feature a few items that I got at a flea market for a very, very cheap price. I'm a collector of vintage toys and toys in general. And here's what I got at my latest hunt. Boom. There you go, a He-Man Battle Cat. Bear the way it is. I got this guy for 10 bucks. Off a stand, a woman was selling them. Um, she said she was selling them for her son, who gave her a whole bunch of stuff to take. Uh, forgive all the white spots, those are chips on the desk. Anyway, but I thought it was a pretty good deal for $10. Uh, I didn't have them, so I wanted to buy them. And boom, there he is right there. And I got an, something else for another five bucks, boom. And she sold it to me for five bucks because of the, the uh, flock coming off and uh, it looks pretty bad, right? <laughs> but $5, you can't beat it. Pretty sweet. So these are the two that I got. There, the flock on this side's not bad. They don't go for a, a huge amount of money on eBay or anything like that. But uh, since I saw them there, I was like, well, let me go ahead and pick them up. I just wanted to go ahead and buy them. So I just wanted to kind of show what I got there. And then another $5 got me this guy. Stratus got the action going on and he's bare bones as you can see no accessories soft head there he is right there I got that guy and uh, I buy with I don't have the intention of selling any of my stuff unless I had it in my collection for a long time then I'll go ahead and sell it but I don't have any intention of selling these things um, just some stuff that I saw from the 80s I wanted to pick them up I had all these when I was a kid no longer have them now I have these and then I got man at arms I got this guy for another five dollars so I got a pretty good deal overall um, no accessories to them whatsoever but that's okay um, the memories are, are, are what I was buying um, when you buy toys like this you, you basically are you're buying childhood um, and that's what I'm doing I used to play with these guys when the ditches in my neighborhood would get flooded with water when I was a kid believe it or not I jump in those ditches with my with my uh, he-man figures and just start swimming around and, and, and you know playing around with them and, and fighting them you gotta pick up boom but uh <laughs> but uh, i didn't get a chance to go hunting this weekend the weather was pretty bad uh down here in south texas uh a lot of these flea markets they close at about 3 30 or 4 o'clock even the really big ones like uh, there's one in alamo texas uh that's pretty pretty huge that i intended to go to and film but i couldn't do it because the uh, the weather was bad but that'll probably be my next video. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and go to uh, that uh, that location, film, maybe uh, maybe head down to another city and check out those. Uh, probably do some uh, garage sales. We'll see what I can find. This is a really quick, short video just to show what I got at the flea market the last time I was out there in Brownsville, Texas, um, buying stuff. And uh, this is basically what I look for: vintage figures, garage sales, flea markets. Uh, I have intentions to go to Corpus San Antonio um, here pretty soon, so uh, get ready some, for some videos on that. Uh, I still have to go to a lot of collectibles places down here where I'm from and to kind of feature them and, and show you what, what they offer. But um, anyways guys, thanks for coming by, taking a look at the video. Like, comment, subscribe, and as always, look at this guy, he doesn't want to stand, as always, keep collecting.